The summer heat has a lot of people hitting the water, but tonight there are new concerns about E. coli at local beaches. 7 Action News reporter Brianne Palmerini live at St. Clair Metro Park tonight to explain what to look out for. Brianne. Well, Curtis and Glenda, the beach here at the Metro Park is closed tonight because there are elevated levels of E. coli in the water. That announcement just happened this afternoon, just a couple of hours ago. Actually, they put the sign up and beachgoers were told to not get in the water. These beachgoers now sitting out on the shore because of that E. coli levels. They're dangerous levels, according to natural resource officials here at the park. They tell me it's tough to say why the E. coli levels are so high right now, but it could be weather related. They say, though, that's just an issue. It's just kind of a gamble. They're just not sure right now. At this point, but the Macomb County Health Department will be testing the water daily while it is unsafe. And the news comes just as we're about to head into the weekend on this muggy summer day, and many beachgoers are upset. I went inside and we both did, and then um, actually one of the little girls came up to us and said, Hey, don't go in the water. It's you know, it's filled with bacteria. Kind of freaked out. <laughs> we kind of ran out of there. But no, I'm kind of scared I'm going to get sick now. I was actually shocked. We just came here, and my daughter is obviously has a cast, so she can't do much, but I maybe she could, like, splash around, like, on the shore. But seeing that, I, I automatically didn't know what was wrong. Not just the beach at the Metro Park that's closed. The Memorial Park Beach at St. Clair Shores is also closed tonight until further notice. Again, these beaches closed until further notice. They will be testing the levels here in the water, but they really don't have a set time as to when these beaches will reopen, just when the E. coli levels drop. Live at St. Clair Shores Metro Park, Brian Pomerini, 7 Action News. Another